Hi everyone and happy Wednesday. It's Kayla and Nancy here. Hello. Um, you can't see our faces because for some reason my camera doesn't want to work. So we're using mom's to do this camera. And it's weird because it's a little glitchy too. So just work with us hopefully. Um, and we'll get through this live together. We didn't want to cancel it because that wouldn't be fun. Uh, no. No. So, um, yeah. That's... Where's your computer? Don't worry. Don't okay. Worry. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, it's all, we're all a little discombobbled here with, uh, with our devices not working. That's the strangest thing. We've been having issues the past few times. Um, if you yeah. guys have been with us on Friday or Wednesday nights, I want to say Friday night still. God, we haven't done a Friday night in a long time. <laughs> a really long time. Um, so yeah, so we're here. We're just, you can't see our faces right now. If you are here with us, please leave a comment. Kind of like what Mary, Karen, and Jill are doing. Hello, Hello ladies. Hello. Welcome. Hello. We are so excited to have you here tonight. Um, we got some fun things that are coming up, um, especially this coming weekend for World Card Making Day. Um, so excited. You guys are going to love the cards that we made. Um, but to get us started, I wanted to just let you guys know that today is the last day to get the Get and Go Starter Kit promotion. And if you wanted to become a discount shopper or happy shopper with a discount, you certainly can do that. We would love to have you on our team. Um, the Get and Go, you get... All this product right here, you get two stamp sets, some rhinestones, and uh, 16 make and take type packets um, that you can use for yourself. Or if you want to, you can share them with your friends and have a class to get some extra sales in for yourself. So today is the last day to take advantage of that. Awesome deal. Um, another thing that is starting since today is the very last day. If you were to take advantage of this today... Tomorrow. All right. Hold me. on. <laughs> what? What? Well, you're just taking. I'm your, just saying. I'm trying yet. to make sure I grab the one. Tomorrow, if you're a demonstrator, some cool things. You get to pre-order a new product that's coming out. Kirby Celebrations. It's called Kirby Celebrations, and it's going to be available November third until January fourth. I want to make that card. I know. Isn't that cool? It's so pretty. Um, this is going to be available for customers to purchase on November 3rd. However, if you take advantage of this get and go package, um, you as a demonstrator tomorrow can purchase this pre-order. How awesome is that? We're already going to be ordering this tomorrow. Super excited. Um, also starting tomorrow for customers and demonstrators, they're having a designer series paper sale at 15% off. Now, if you are a demonstrator, your starting discount is 20% off. So that would be 35% off the regular price of $11.50. Right now, tomorrow... So this, what is that? Like $8? I don't know. I don't know. I didn't figure it out. You did because you were Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What was it? It was... I have it written down on that piece of paper. It is... Seven... If it's... Tw oh, you didn't have it. So nine oh, seventy eight. Nine seventy eight. Nine point seven eight ten twenty seven dollars and eighty two cents. Seven eighty two th these packets of paper would cost if you were a demonstrator because you get that fifteen percent off plus the twenty percent off your normal discount, which is pretty cool. So these are all the papers that are gonna be available tomorrow for their designy series paper sale. So excited. We're going to be ordering some of this right here, the trimming the town tomorrow. Trown. The town. <laughs> so just some fun things that are coming up. Um, the get and go package, again, today is the last day to take advantage of this. So I'm going to put that off to the side. However, we have World Card Making Day coming up. Saturday. This Saturday. Now, again, Miss Kayla isn't going to be around. However, we're going to have three pre-recorded videos. We're going to be making... Um, three, three cards. different cards on those video. One video will have the one card, and then we'll have a couple samples extra to show you. Um, then the next video will have a totally different set, and so on for the third one. Um, and then if you comment throughout the week on one of our social pla uh, social media platforms, well, it no, hold on, you're gonna confuse them. So the same three videos are gonna go up on YouTube, on Facebook, and on Instagram. 
And it, you have to comment on those videos itself. You can't just comment on whatever you want. It right. has to be those videos. Right. And so if you comment on those videos on one of the social platforms, um, you will be in for a drawing for a grand prize. A grand prize that we'll be doing the following Saturday on the 10th. We'll be going live that day. We'll be doing three more cards for you mm -hmm. since we weren't able to join you live this Saturday. We'll do three more cards using those three same stamp sets. Um, however, if you purchase something from us uh, during the week, um, if you place an order at our online store, an uh, order that has to be a minimum of $35, we'll send you those make and takes for those videos that we did on Saturday the 3rd. Yeah, the pre-recorded ones. Yes. Yep. Um, unfortunately, this doesn't count towards the monthly uh, product of the month. Um, because we're giving you the make and takes to go with those videos. Um, just a special that we're running uh, for the week for World Card Making Day. Um, so make sure you hop back and check us out. But today we're going to work on two fun things. They're really cute. Oh my gosh. So we're going to make this card right here. The Happy Haunting. And I don't think I did the inside. Nope. nope. And then we got this cute little treat holder. Um, I've got two little Heath candy bars, two little tiny little treats in here, but we're going to be making these two here today. Um, we're making our own designer series paper, you guys. Look <laughs> at that. I love it. That's always fun. Um, I like bright colors and to me, uh, the, our Halloween colors, I just couldn't get inspired to create with it. Um, the black and white ones I was okay with, but I don't know. I like bright, fun Halloween colors, and um, so I decided what what better thing to do than to make our own. So we are using the Banner Year stamp set, and the Banner Year comes as a bundle, and the bundle that it comes with is this punch right here. And I don't have the price offhand because my catalog is over there, but you purchase this together, you'll get 10% off. If you are a demonstrator, you get your 20% off plus that additional 10% off this bundle if you buy it together. So that's technically 30% off. So that's a good deal. Um, anyway, we're not going to be using the punch that goes with this. We're just going to be using the stamp set. We're going to be using the spider right here. That, I think um, it goes with it, but is it a bundle? I don't think it's a bundle. Oh, isn't it a bundle? I no, thought it was. That, the, the postage uh, punch, mm -hmm. it goes with the... Ah, uh, it goes with another stamp set. Okay, but we're talking um, about Banner Year. Oh, Banner Year. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm like, what? I'm confused. No, the what postage one. one. My yeah. bad. Yeah, it's I'm Banner confused. Year. <laughs> okay, so we're using the spider web here to design our paper. And then we're going to be using the Happy Haunting and the Boo for the front on our messages. And then this die right here, I'll show you where we get that from. So I got all our paper cut up. And I did... What? I did have, um, can you reach over there? I think I took it out. I had to have. I the don't know what you're here, talking. The dies right there. Which ones? Just give me the whole stack right there. I don't know which ones. Okay, because I'm thinking I just picked them up. Nope, that's not it. Yep. I am looking for the a Christmas one with the sleigh. Oh, the North Pole. Yep. Guys, that, that's over here, isn't it? Oh, did I take them out over there? So. Oh, you probably did, I bet, huh? Nope because you were doing the typing up the instructions okay hold hold on one well, moment you you and I'll find it. okay so anyway um, we need the dies for the treat for this bag right here um, we are using the smallest stitch circle right here and then this one is in with this the not the stitch dies but the um, the treat box this black circle right here um, these ones right here are in the Christmas one. Hold on. I think it's not over here, Kayla? No, it's not. Well, what in the world? Where did it go there, bud? I have no idea. Oh, no. Oh, hold the phone there. Did you? All right. Well, what I'll do is, since we can't find them, I mean, seriously, they're on a big, huge plastic uh, thing like this. Oh, you know what? <laughs> They're under here. Oh my god, mom. <laughs> Lord help us. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have this plastic container with all my supplies. I had them sitting right under it. Oh my goodness sakes, you guys. Seriously. She's, 
You know, she gives me a headache sometimes. <sighs> yeah, but the feeling's mutual, my darling. My feelings what? are mutual. No. <laughs> Never. We use this big one here, this circle from the North Pole Wonders. Now I took, normally I like to try and just stay with one bundle and stick with it, but you know what? Sometimes I'm kind of limited on what I want to do, so I thought I'm going to just use dyes from all over the place. This uh, black circle we did right here, and then the stitch circles. So we'll show you those again as I have Kayla help us do some die cutting. All right, so. To get started, we're going to need scrap pieces of paper, the, the Whisper White and the Black. And then I'm going to have Miss Kayla cut us a piece for what if I don't want to? <laughs> a 6x6 six six Whisper White that we're going to be using for our little box. Looks. And um, we got our normal layers. We're going to do one for the inside, one for the outside. I got some extra spiders that I die cut it out in the um, black glimmer or shimmer paper. I think it's shimmer. <laughs> I stop, I'm like, no. Oh. Uh. <laughs> so anyways, I'm just gonna get all my supplies out because I already got them on blocks. And of course we're gonna be using Kayla's favorite ribbon that we need to order more Duh, of. Oh, we have to. Because <laughs> this is our last roll and we need to get some more. So, okay. It's our last one. Yes, it is. Okay, we gotta order. So this is, what, we have one, two, three, we have six of your ribbon. <laughs> How do we not we do. have one, six two, three, of mine? Four, five, six. Oh my gosh, that's funny. We have six of the silver metallic edge ribbon, and that, that is mom's. That is favorite ribbon. She uses is. it everywhere. And then we're on the last bolt of mine. What the heck? I don't know. Mom. I keep I keep an eye on my ribbon. You need to keep an eye on. Oh, your we haven't ribbon. put an order in yet. No, we haven't. We're doing that tomorrow not in the morning. Okay. So. Do you want me to add that? Maybe. Yeah, I'll write it, yeah. Okay. All right, so what we're going to do is we're just going to randomly stamp. We're going to be using our gorgeous grape. We used mango. We used pumpkin pie. And then we're using our memento. Okay? And all we're going to do is just randomly stamp on our whisper white. And I kind of make a mess. Now, I, I did get a couple impressions from the block because I was kind of like just hurrying up and we may have that happen today but we'll see but because the paper the the paper is so busy afterwards that you can't even tell if you make a mistake nobody will know okay all right so hopefully I got enough ink oh no how's everybody's week going so far I think we're doing okay I hope we're live oh, no no <laughs> <laughs> oh we're loading i think i just keep going oh gosh you guys this is so sad i wonder if we need to change nights we haven't done anything hmm strange it's just i don't know it might be on my end maybe it's just our end you guys are still seeing us let us know hopefully i'm not going too far off no you're good here. you're good okay uh -oh. oh dear oh, oh. hey i did have that I did have that door shut. Why is blue in here? I don't know. Well, it's just uh, hmm. one of those nights. One I of those guess. nights, and our cats are getting into fights, and oh, Lord, have mercy. Okay, so as you can see, I kind of got a little crazy. Now, yes, I got a big stamp for, or a big block. I like putting my stamps on big blocks, I feel like I have more control over them. However, I have to be careful when I'm stamping that I don't get this on the paper. And that's exactly what I was talking about. I got some of this on my paper on one of these projects, and you can't even tell um, that that had happened. Okay, so I'm just going to wash this off a little bit here with our, our chamois. Give it a good clean. All right. Now I'm going to go in with our Mango Melody. And we're just randomly placing these all over the place. No rhyme or Wherever reason. Wherever you want. Wherever you want them. Okay. Everybody can see us still, so that's that's okay. all that matters. That's good. Now, like I was saying earlier, I, I love bright colors. And the Halloween paper this year was just not my favorite. And I was finding really a hard time um, getting inspiration with it. And... You know, that happens. That happens sometimes. You know, sometimes the designer series paper just isn't for you. 
Um, but I felt like I wasn't doing it justice. Um, and so, you know, I hope you guys are able to use it and... and, and the magic uh, in this night? Yes, yes. Um, I think I did use it on some of the projects. Why am I having a problem with this? Okay, Kayla, you take care of that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'll close it. She's like, okay. Probably drop it right on my face. Oh, yeah, that happens. Ooh, on your face? That means you'd have to do it up, side down. Upside down? How would you do that? Uh, I don't know. I don't know either. Nope. Okay. So we're just placing these wherever you feel like. Do, 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 do. Yes, we have had a very, very busy week. We have been busy creating for our our uh, event this weekend. The uh, we got a lot going on this weekend. Wow. We got the three videos that are going to go live, and we have co coordinating um, blog posts with them, so you can see all the measurements in one spot and all the information on how to do orders if you want to get those free make and takes. Plus, uh, I had to make graphics for all of them. Yes, she's been. Yeah. And um, then we're also doing a blog hop. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. And on Saturday. And on Saturday. Mm -hmm. So we're just busy over here. Yeah, we've been busy creating. Um, tomorrow we're doing a blog hop uh, with Stephanie Pletcher, and it's actually going to be on these cards right here. I thought, why not? Um, the theme was um, Howling Halloween, and um, we need to post the, the uh, measurements and everything, and I thought, well, we'll just use those. No sense in recreating the wheel again. So... Um, tomorrow at eight o'clock in the morning, these the the directions or or the um, measurements, excuse me, um, will be up on our blog for sure. Okay, so now here, see this little piece right there. That you won't even be able to tell. Um, oh yeah, you can't even see. Yeah, you got like I got a little bit. Something. No, it's it's part of the stamp right there. Oh yeah, oops. so you can't even tell. Once you get your card all put together, it'll be covered up by something, and yeah. So that's the thing that's kind of cool about this. <laughs> I really? love it. Okay, so randomly place this wherever you want. Um, and then on Saturday, we're gonna be doing a World Card Making Day. Um, the card that we are featuring in the blog hop is different from the ones that we are creating throughout the day on Saturday. So I think that's pretty busy enough. Okay, so we got that one down. <laughs> All right. Wow, we have Joanne, Joanne, and Joanna. Oh, wow. On our YouTube channel watching Hello. us. Oh, <laughs> wow, my goodness. Okay. Party over there. So now it's the party of the Joannes. Joannes. All right. Joanne. So what I'm doing is I'm, this is going to be on the inside of the card and I've got ink all over. So do expect to get a little inky when you're doing this. And I'm going to close this up. Yeah. I just can't figure out why our camera just, or my camera doesn't want to work. And Kayla's camera is more it's newer. It's newer. I was going to say more newer. <laughs> more newer. It's more newer guys. It's a new language night tonight for me. All right, so we're gonna get the orange on here. <laughs> Stamp, stamping away. So is anybody else doing anything on Saturday for the World Card Making Day? You getting together with any friends? Doing it, yeah, I don't, I don't you know. You guys registered for any classes out there that are available? Are there classes out there available? Yeah, some other demonstrators might have things going on. Yeah, who knows? I don't know. Um, Kathy said, Rachel said that she had weird stuff happening all day, too, while she was doing her videos. Oh, Lord. Yeah, I don't know. It's And we both have the same internet, so I don't know what the deal is. Yeah, and that's what Kathy, Kathy. was like. Maybe it's the different weather we got going on. It's been oh. rainy. And then it was sunny, like blue sky sunny, and then all of a sudden you just started hearing thunder, and you're like, what is yeah. this? Yeah, it, it's a crazy <laughs> afternoon, I'm telling you. Just a little bit. Just a tiny bit. All right, so we're going to be done here with this. I think that should be enough for the inside. Oh, okay. she goes by Joe, by the way. Joe. Okay. Joe. Got you. All right, so now we're just going to assemble this basic card. 
Um, we are going to be doing the eight and a half by five and a half, scored at four and a quarter. We're just going to layer. Um, our Whisper White is uh, probably, let me just take a peek see here to see what I have it cut at. Okay, yep. This uh, Whisper White is three and three fourths by five. The black, basic black, is um, four and one eighth. No, it's four. <laughs> what oh, are you? Lord. Mom, just stop. Yes, it's we'll four have it in the by box. five and a quarter. There it is. Sorry. Four by five and a quarter? Yes. Okay. Goodness me, am I? I know. I know. That was uh, kind of scary there. That was, a, that was a big one there for me, Kayla. Yeah, I'm just it, saying. Like, <laughs> 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 Heather said, my cousin, aunts, uh, mom, sister, and I are getting together to make cards. I have 20 make and takes planned for them. Whoa. Wow. That is awesome. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's a lot of work. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, but good for you. How exciting. That'd be really fun. Uh, Kathy said, making cards and watching videos on Saturday. Oh, yay. Yeah, last year we were at my dad's up north in Moorhead, and <laughs> the internet was... Oh, yeah, that was something. a that was a mess. That was know? yeah. It, that was a big old mess. Yeah, but we we still had fun. My goodness, I think we went live every other hour. No, every yeah, two every, hours. Every other hour. I every think. other hour, and um, we did it for like pretty much the whole day. I think didn't we? Like from yeah. ten until like seven at night or six at night, something like that. There was it was a lot. It of was it was a long day. But we had so much fun. I even have, gosh, I think we even got a picture of Andy massaging my shoulders. Because <laughs> I was sitting at my dad's kitchen table. Too funny. And then here we are, COVID 2020, dealing with... Who would have thought? <laughs> yeah, I mean, seriously. You know, our in-person events, and it's kind of sad. But... Um, I am happy to say, though, next week, oh, and I forgot, oh. I did put the ribbon around the edges, so we're going to do this, you guys. I'm going to do the faux bow thing, you know me. We're going to do that faux bow. So I'm just going to take a little bit of ribbon, and I'm going to cut it off right about here. Got too busy trying to put my layers, and not she, paying attention, she guys. started talking. I started That's talking and not paying attention, and, you know... Some of this stuff just comes secondhand, you know, kind of like when you get in your car and you're, you get in the car and your car just wants to go one direction because it's so used to just driving that one direction. Oh, hi, Don. Yeah. She said hello from hello. Washington State. So glad I finally caught you live. Oh, yay. So happy you're here. Moved from Wisconsin a year ago. Still trying to find my way around. Why did you move out there? Oh, my goodness. Curious. Very curious. It's a big move. Okay, so I'm going to pop this one right on top. Again, you're going to want to put your ribbon on beforehand, but because I was too busy yip yapping, we're going to slide it in. Right here, I put a glue dot on there. So when I push down, it should stay right there. And now what I'm going to do is put a little glue dot on this end. Pop that up a little. Where's my glue dots? I don't get it. Does, it kind of looks fuzzy. <laughs> Are we fuzzy? I, it's weird because on the streaming thing it doesn't look fuzzy, but then like on YouTube and on Facebook it looks fuzzy oh, to me. Oh lord, I hope not. Who knows, honestly. I, it's so frustrating, you know, because yeah. I haven't adjusted anything. Like, it, it, it was been working fine this whole time. Well, yeah. Darcy it's says she bummer. loves that ribbon. That's my kind of girl. <laughs> this <laughs> is. That's my favorite ribbon. It's so much fun. Okay, so how easy is that? You can just tuck it around the corners with a little glue dot and be good with it. All right, so since you guys all know that I am a very bow challenged, I am going to be bringing out this bow maker. It's Breezy Bows by Vicki Spicer and Rob. Um, I'm going to be making a double bow. And... Actually, I'm curious to see how you do this because I've never actually like watched you do it. Oh, it's super easy. Just wrap it around one more time. That's uh, it. I'll just keep doing you and then okay. I'll look. So I am just, yep, I think I made it bigger. So I'm going to take one of these out and move it so I can get it a little bigger. Because I, I did it double. And it just, I don't know. 
I thought it looked really cute and I like it looking a little wider. I could spread them apart, but I like the look of that ribbon right there. So, okay. So, go looking, around. Yep, do our normal thing and then we just go around one more time. Oh, ta da! Well, okay. And that's it. Now, for this, we go over. Over. Oops. Hold on. Over and under. Okay. Opity. And then we make our four. Four. The number, or the number, the number, the letter. The letter four. The letter four. Yeah, that's. That, that. I definitely. learned my ABCs from Sesame Street. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, are you sure? Okay. It probably was uh, Count Dracula who was could have uh, been teaching you exactly, or Cookie Monster. Oh yeah. C's okay. So there we have it. We got a double bow. Ta-da! All right. So I'm just gonna cut that off for now, and we'll trim that up here in a in a smidge. But I do need your assistance, Miss Kayla Corey. Me? Yes, me. What am I gonna do? I would like it if you could die cut a couple things for me. Okay. So for this card, we're going to be using a lot circle. Okay. And we're going to be using this right here. And that's in the North Pole Wonder. Okay. And I'm not going to stamp until I get my die cuts, which I probably should have done that beforehand. And then while we're at it, for our little treat right here, we're going to take the smallest circle on the stitched shapes and die cut that. Actually, we could do that together on, on the video. You here. want me to bring it over there? Yeah, sure. Why not? And then we got the little treat box that we're going to be using a little bit here. We're going to take this off and die cut this as well at the same time. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. No, no. Sure. Okay, dokie. Are you ready for this? I am. Monster? I am. Machine. Oh goodness! Not that heavy. Oh you! I make it look, sound no. like it's a lot more heavy than it is. It's not. <laughs> it's not. And oh my gosh, I love this. It's so awesome. Karen says she's loving this. Okay, so now um, a lot of people have been saying that they've been having issues with their um, uh, magnetic pad, and so far Kayla and I really haven't had any issues with ours. Um, if you find that it's buckling too much, I guess what Kayla and I do is we'll either lay it down on here and put another plate on it and let it rest overnight. Or sometimes, you know, I noticed people said they were having issues. I'll flip it over and just let it rest until the next time I go to use it. Or, or if you, you know, some people are saying they're putting it under books. Um, I don't know why it wouldn't straighten out. I guess maybe I'm not using mine as much where I'm not getting a bowing. But so far, we haven't had any issues. So um, if you do have issues with yours, I would say give demonstrator or demonstrator support. Um, give Stampin' Up! a call and um, let them know that you're having issues and maybe they got some solutions for you um, that we're not aware of as demonstrators. So, okay, we're going to cut all four pieces out right away. Um, we had our platform one, two, um, our magnetic plate, and then we just need one clear plate, one number three on top, and just crank it on through. Crank it through. Crank it through. All right, there we go, guys. Easy peasy. Okay, now we got Oops. this one. Oopsie daisy what? <laughs> I accidentally changed the screen. Oh, Lord. Now, that was Kayla that did that, whatever she did. Yeah, my bad. That was my fault. She's farting around over here, guys. I'm telling you. Got to keep an eye on her. I Well, see, I forgot we didn't have the dimensional count on, so I, I just went and copied it. and then. Oh, the dimensional count. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. That was so funny. What was the last week that you did that? You put 100 on last there? Last week or the week before? Oh, I my gosh. Hundred. That was so funny. Who? <laughs> Kathy popped on, and she's like, oh, my gosh, 100. Was it Amy? I don't remember. Who was it? Oh, my gosh. I was laughing so hard. Okay, so here we have the, the spider right here that we cut out. All right, so put back these dies right away so I don't lose them. And then this is, and We know when you lose something, you I lose, lose it. it. <laughs> Unless it's underneath the basket and right in front of your face. Exactly. Now that's misplacing. Losing is, is, is completely oh, different. Oh, you said you lost it. 
Oh, I did? I don't know. Oh, okay. <laughs> Somebody go back and replay yeah. the video. <laughs> Get rid on that. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to take these out. And we are now ready for our little sayings. I got blue on here and happy haunting. We're going to use purple, my favorite color. And we're going to stamp these up while we have the ink in front of us. So on the little circle, we're just going to do the purple. Just says boo in the middle. Hey, did you guys like that meme that I made today? Oh, that one, yeah. <laughs> I showed it to mom. It didn't originally said that. It said something else. And I was looking at it, I'm like, I don't She's get like, it. I don't get it. I don't get I'm it. I'm like, well. It's like you telling me about my cards. It was and about like, Aquariuses, and it was like Aquariuses being proud of something that they made, and then their moms pretending to like, like, pretend to be interested or proud of their work. <laughs> And so I just made it into Nancy and Kayla so she could understand. <laughs> and, but the thing is, is I don't do that to her. I'm, I'm a good mom. Oh, sure. I'm a good mom. You're like, okay, Kayla, good job. Good job, Kayla. Good job. I'm so proud of you. I don't know. It doesn't seem that authentic. <laughs> You're so funny. I don't know. Okay, so now we're going to take our spider web. By the way, FYI, I hate spiders. I hate spiders. But this one's kind of cute. Now, we had trinkets a couple years ago um, for Halloween, and uh, yeah, uh, not a fan. I did not buy them because they were too freaky, creepy looking. So, yeah, I, I, I didn't get them. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's a great story. I know, right? Thanks for sharing. I know. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> Amy doesn't like spiders. Jill doesn't like spiders. Oh, gosh, does anybody hates. not like not? Does anybody like spiders? Okay, so of those of you who don't like spiders, do you like snakes? Ooh, would you rather deal with snakes or spiders? Because we we have a snake upstairs, and he's actually getting pretty big. He is that small circle. He is getting big, Kayla. He's yeah, about the size he's... of that little s around. Now, he's, he's about that big. He's grown. Vicky and Mary are going to be like, what? Yeah, he's... He was he's a little a squirt snake. last year. Oh, we're not doing purple on this. What am I doing? See? I'm drawn See, to purple. See, you're just not a lot of talk in me. I am. Okay, so I have a... I just did this color. Um, I had a friend of mine sign up to be Mary Kay, and, uh, a Mary Kay demonstrator, and I was online looking at a catalog because I do ever and I, I I sell ever but I really haven't gotten into the selling point I'm my best customer right now yeah <laughs> <laughs> um, so there's nothing wrong with that um, but I love the ever products and so um, I told my friend I'm like I was on there trying to figure out what I wanted to buy, and I thought, okay, I'll buy a lipstick or something, or a chapstick, or whatever they have. So I was looking, and when I was looking at their lip glosses, I came across this one that caught my eye right away. You guys want to know what, what the name of it was called? Or is called? <laughs> Get this. The color that I, I absolutely love is called Fancy Nancy. Fancy Nancy. Fancy Nancy. I was yeah. like... Oh my God, seriously? <laughs> I couldn't believe it. So, yeah. Anyway, fun fact. Cool story. I thought so. Mm hmm Yeah. Um, that's funny, though, because um, I told Ellie, my friend, mm -hmm. um, that Reba's song, Fancy, oh. <laughs> I, always, I always kid around with Mom whenever it comes on. I, um... I always say, here's your one chance, Nancy, don't let me down. <laughs> <laughs> and so I told I told my friend that, and now every time she hears that song, she takes a picture and sends it to me, and she's like, don't let me down, Nancy. Don't let me down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good Lord. Okay, so now we're just going to go ahead and adhere these on. Hey, you guys, I haven't fought with this tape yet tonight. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now that you say that. Why did I say that? Uh-huh. As soon as I said that. Oh, my good golly. Seriously. <laughs> wow. Good golly, Molly. Oh, good golly. There we go. Now, I just put X's on the back there. I don't know what you guys do. I figured it Kathy, works. Kathy, or Jill said snakes. Kathy said neither. Um, our Kathy... 
Uh, second Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> Kathy number 10? No. <laughs> Spiders don't bother me, but I do kill them when I see them. Ooh. Darcy, I hate snakes. I can kill a spider with my shoe. Jill said snakes are cool with a whole bunch of snake emojis. Oh, who, who said that? Jill. Oh, Jill. K Mary Ellen Did said... Did we know that? I don't know. Oh. Jill, or er, Mary Ellen said I don't like either. <laughs> and then Kathy Brown said, like that song and Reba. Reba's awesome. Okay, so we still do have Black Dimensionals in our annual catalog, and I am just using up this little bit that I have here. <laughs> Kayla, I have no idea what these are going to count as because they're just bits and pieces that I cut up. I'd Ooh. say that's four. Um, but I added more. Mm. Oh, sorry. Amy said no on snakes. Don said spiders, no on the snake. Mm. Um, you guys look at that. Joanne Peterson has said, if it doesn't walk upright on two feet, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Cute. <laughs> five, five each, said Amy, for the dimensionals. So what color was that Fancy Nancy lip gloss? Um, It was kind of like a... Petal pink color. No, it wasn't petal pink. It was, it was more like a of a... Glossy petal pink. <sighs> like, look at that ribbon, the sheer ribbon of petal pink up there. It's like that color. I want to say it's like this one right here. No, to the left. No. No. Uh, uh, no. It's not it that was dark. More, it was kind of like this. Yeah, it was. It was kind of a shimmery look like that. Yeah. Kind of a shimmery like that. Okay. Here we go. We're going to put this. Oh, you're right. It's darker. Yeah. Wait. Maybe okay. I could pull it up and then you could just see it. Okay. So now. Oh, there. Right. Ah. No! Oh! <laughs> That's a meme. You don't want to see that. Wait, where'd it go? That one. Oh, shoot. I'm out of camera. That one. That one right there. This is Fancy Nancy. You can't see it. There it is. Fancy Nancy. <laughs> <laughs> what are the odds? Too funny. Okay, so now we're ready to put on our lovely bow. And I'm actually going to put two glue dots on this puppy because I don't want this little guy getting lost. We're just going to plop them right on there, like so. Ta-da! Okay. And then we're going to put a couple spiders on. And, of course, we're going to yes. pop him up on dimensionals. Now, I could put one big fat one on there, but we're going to put a couple small ones on there. Um, Carolyn said you have to have spiders for Halloween. Oh, gosh. Telling ya. I think I got bit by one in my sleep the other night. Oh, don't say that. <laughs> Please do not say do that. Do not say that. Um, Kayla has been a very busy bee. Did I put one on these? Maybe I did only put one. Oh, look at yeah. that. I did. She's been working me real hard. I have been. I deep cleaned the garage. like Put including... that stand together. Yep. Hold on. I deep cleaned the garage. So, like, I went down. Well, we organized it. And then we um, got rid of stuff and donated stuff. Two car loads. Two car loads. And then... I sprayed down the garage floor and then I scrubbed it with a broom and Dawn dish soap. <laughs> you had to get the grease. And then the... rinsed it all out. And then after that was dry, then I primed the wall. Um, one wall in First our garage. One, second one. What did you do differently? Nothing. Oh. Uh, then saying. why are you saying the first one? The first one, the second one. They match. What do you do? <laughs> <laughs> but um, then I primed a wall because it was just straight up drywall, so it I had is. to prime it. And then the next day I painted the wall, and then I put together this huge, like, I don't even know how heavy it was. It was. <laughs> storage <laughs> shelf. It was so funny trying to watch us get it in the it, cart. When we were at uh, Lowe's trying to get it in the cart, yeah, they were if you guys would have seen us, you would have been laughing your butts oh, off. I was, was. I was laughing, and Mom was like, don't make me laugh, because, you know, when you laugh, you can't carry stuff. Yeah, then you end up dropping everything. Because you're not engaging your muscles because you're <laughs> laughing. Like Either that, or you're too busy trying not to pee your pants <laughs> there because was, you're laughing so yeah, hard. Yeah, there was one point I had my foot on the cart because I was trying to hold the cart down while Mom was pushing the huge box onto the cart, but then I accidentally let go from the ground so then she was just pushing, pushing me on the, the cart pushing her in the car <laughs> we were 
a mess. <laughs> Luckily, nobody was down the aisle oh that we God. went down. Yeah. <laughs> It was funny. He had to be there, I guess, but it was funny. <laughs> it was hilarious. Okay. Yeah, and then, um, not yesterday, but the day before, so that would have been, what, Monday? Monday. I don't know. <laughs> um, I w yeah, Monday morning, because I woke up and I thought, oh my God, there's a turd. A little mouse turd. Oh, yeah. Um, by the kitty's food in the laundry room, and I thought, oh no, I hit the panic button and trying to get everything, um, uh, ordered and oh my god this is like six o'clock in the morning yeah I'm, before I'm, I'm awake she's like Kayla we got a mouse we got a mouse in the house <laughs> and so then Kayla goes you know when she finally woke up okay you guys I'm sorry I'm talking this is six by six whisper white that's all it is okay now we're gonna do the same thing we're just gonna stamp random Oh, Kathy, so want to come to my house this week and help me organize my garage. We live close and I'll provide the wine. <laughs> Ooh, wine. Well, I'm going to be out of town this weekend. <laughs> hey, you know what? But we might have to take you up on that sometime. Yeah. We have free wine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so then on Monday, Kayla's like, um, I said, Kayla, I got to work, you know, and I'm like, I need your help. Can you help clean the laundry room? So she moved the washer and dryer, literally paint, moved it, swept, swept under, under it, it, washed it, washed it, it by, by hand, like on my hands and knees. Uh, and we have a tiny laundry room. Mm -hmm. And then, oh, uh, while well, our vent, our vent from our dryer was dripping. It was dripping. And I'm and like, it was clogged. Yes. Yeah, so I, moisture. yep. So then I got a guy to come out. Um, yesterday and he blew it out and now my clothes dry in a matter of seconds practically <laughs> it's been about five years since I've had my dryer vents uh, dryer vent cleaned you guys you need to do that every two years approximately so just just a heads up I didn't know that <laughs> I, I thought you know five years not too bad no mom. no yeah. <laughs> Don't so anyway, he came and cleaned that out and uh, yeah Kayla's been getting her work out and then today she hit it hard trying to get our um, Oh, uh, our, our stuff for Saturday for World Cup. Yeah, Day. yeah. So we've been, it's been a busy couple weeks here. I'm telling you, it has been busy, but it's been good. It's been fun. Um, I feel very productive over the past few days. Um, we got a lot of things coming up, you guys. We've got, um, I still have to design a class that we're going to be doing in October. Haven't done that yet. Um, hoping to get that done here at some point. You just talk a lot, don't you? I do. I do. See? Now I got a little bit of ink on that right there. Whose fault is that? That that would be mine, but that's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Don't, don't get all bent out of shape there. Okay. <laughs> or you could just clean it again, but you know, knowing me, I'm going to get ink all over again. So, yeah. you know, just go with the flow. Are we surprised? No. No. Mm -mm. Not at all. Not at all. Zero amount. So now if you are new to stamping, um, you want to give the effect that uh, by stamping off the paper a little bit, it just gives it a, a, a more authentic look of designer series paper or specialty paper. It's kind of cool. I was so amazed by that. I'm like, oh, that's really cool that you can do Stamp that. Off of it. Yes. <laughs> okay. Now this is making me a little bit more nervous. So I'm going to clean that off. <laughs> Darcy said, do you guys hire out? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> we have, and then tonight, I don't know, we just been, uh, yeah, cleaning. And then tonight, um, I was designing a card, uh, last minute decided to do this blog hop, uh, for World Card Making Day. And so I designed the card really quick while Kayla and the kids ran to the store. Andy comes home and that little bugger is running around the house cleaning the house putting things away and I'm like holy moly what's going on he's about when you when you put him up to a task and when he's feeling up to it he can clean the house almost better than me um, yeah like I mean he's, he just goes yeah like, he's really good um Kayla you know when she's in the mood she cleans good Abby mm, not so good not so good does gotta, she ever clean? Uh, um, uh, 
<laughs> Not here. Uh, <laughs> maybe, maybe at her dad's. At her dad's house. Maybe. <laughs> but maybe if I give her money as an incentive, then she will. I bet. Yeah. No? No, because remember she said, oh, if I do my chores, will you pay me? And you're like, yeah. And she hasn't. Yeah, true. Very true. So, mm-hmm. No. Hey, did you know the next full moon is going to be tomorrow? Seriously? <laughs> That's why everybody's going crazy and oh. everything's not working. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that, uh, that could be it? Yep. That's I am, why. I am over stamping. I'm not, this is all willy-nilly, you guys. I don't have no rhyme or reason on what I'm doing in here for stamping. Kathy Brown said Abby likes to cook, right? Um, somewhat. It's weird. She likes to cook, but then she'll try to eat it, and then she's like, nope. Nope, I don't like it. <laughs> oh, girl. I'm so confused. What do you want? She confuses me on a day-to-day basis. It changes, but that's okay. She's a girl. She's a woman. She has a right to. Okay, now we are ready to die-cut this, you guys. Look at this. All right, so six by six. This will fit perfectly. Now, if you have designer series paper... Um, from us they come in packs some of them come in packs of six by six um, they it works perfectly with this die you just got to put it at an angle and just kind of you know maneuver it back and forth when you're putting it on your die cutting plate okay so now I gotta bring that wonderful uh, stamp and cut and boss machine back into the camera Mary Mary said that's just like Sheila I'll say I'll pay her but she still doesn't do it uh-huh I know right all right, so this is going to go in at Kitty Wampus angle right here. All right, and just move it in. Just pay attention to all your little nooks. Edges, your little corner. Your little corners there. And just got to pay attention here. I'm a little concerned about this side over here, so I'm going to move that just a tad up. I think that is good the magnetic plate is perfect for this because then it won't bounce or move when you put your top plate on okay and if you don't have a magnetic plate just use a post-it note yeah post-it notes work really good on keeping your your dies from moving around um, I know I did that a lot uh, when we had our last uh, magnetic plate because there was only certain magnets you know like every inch or so so if you had your die cut or uh, your die in that specific spot it would jump sometimes to wherever the magnet was so it made it kind of difficult to work with sometimes so post-it notes came in really handy for that okay and what's really cool about that plate is that it's magnetic over the whole thing which is really awesome okay so this is how this turned out. It's already it cuts and scores all the pieces for you. And all we need to do is just give these pieces a good fold. And I like to burnish with our bone folders. You can purchase those over on our store as well. As same with our embossing oh, machine. No. What happened? Kathy said you never Kaylee, you never added the dimensional she put on the spiders on her card. I think it was uh -oh. two. Was it two each or one on each? One on each, yep, so two. Okay. Whew. Not bad. Good catch. Good catch. Did you hear mom the panic in her voice? What? What? Did we go did we did we did we die again? Did we die again? Um, on Facebook or... Did our stream end? Oh, every time you do that to me though, I'm like oh, What? No, what? What? <laughs> My bad. I'm it's sorry. It's like when you're driving in a car and your kids are like, ah Oh, Jenny's late to the party. Oh, Jenny. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody make fun of Ginny. Just kidding, don't do that. We don't do that stuff here. Okay, so here we got it. We got everything um, cut uh, and folded, burnished, whatever. Now, you can um, just put this together without using tape and then just tie it, uh, a ribbon on it or staple it and give it to people if you want. Um, to me, I like to make sure that whatever I put on the inside is going to stay and not go anywhere. So preferably, um, I am going to use a little bit of tape. Now, when I put these in, I personally like to go from the back in. However you wanna do it, doesn't make a difference. Um, you can go the other way if you want to, because this is gonna be up and no one's gonna see it, okay? No, that's true. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take our uh, the Seal Plus, and I'm just gonna put one or two little 
little strips on there. As you can see right there, kind of went over the edge, but I think you can see that. Ginny, this is the little treat box die. It is. Absolutely. Okay, so there again, I just got two little ones there, and that'll be good enough to hold this. Okay, and we're going to come in from the back and just slide that puppy in there. Do, do. Okay, now it's got it's all the way in. I'm going to give it a press. And the same thing here. We're going to come in from the back and just give it a good press. All right. So now what I did on mine is I'm going to put a little bit of tape on both sides here. You do not need to, but me being me, I've got to put a little bit of tape on there. But before I do that, I want to just take my bone folder and I want to give this just just a tiny bit of a, of a curve, okay? And you just gently take your bone folder and just run it over the paper like that. And to me, it just kind of gives it a little bit of extra, um, I don't know, extra, I don't know if you want to say, it makes it look more dainty, I guess, than just straight up, you know what I mean? Okay, so we are going to put just a little bit of tape here. It doesn't take much. And a little bit right here. And I'm going to close this side up. Now, for my treats that I have on hand that work absolutely perfect are these little Hershey Kisses right here. Or not Hershey Kisses. Um, Heath. Good Lord. Um, perfect size to put in here, actually. Just a couple of them. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Give that a good rub. All right, so now we got our little box going there. Now we just got to finish the outside. Now I got my spider and this, oops, my spider decided to jump on me. I don't like jumping spiders, by the way. Um, all we need to do is add a little bit of ribbon on here. <laughs> I gotta find my scissors. Okay, hopefully that's big enough. If not, yeah, I think I need more. I got, I got thick thumbs. Okay. You know what Why? they say about thick thumbs. What in the world I did know. I do to my fingers? Oh my gosh, you got wow. all the ink on you. <laughs> what in the world? Hi, Lori. Wow. Ooh, Karen loves Heath bars. I love them. Oh, aren't they good? Actually, it's funny because Heath bars are... The, <laughs> I was not listening to you for there for a while. Oh, I'm sure so, not. <laughs> Am I surprised? No. No. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> what were you doing? Um, stuff. <laughs> oh, God. So since so you weren't we're, okay, wait. Uh, I was gonna tell this story, but I don't know if you if told I told it, it because you weren't I was listening. Like, okay, oh my I gosh, just totally gone with it. Seriously, and like just assumed that you know okay. try, maybe you've gotten by with it. Okay. Did you tell the story about our candy bowl? No. Okay, so <laughs> Jill said you're wasting Kayla's favorite ribbon. I know, right? <laughs> Shh, Jill. Jill. Shh. Shh. <laughs> she almost got away with it, yeah. too. <laughs> um, but our candy bowl, so we bought a mix of candies. It had Kit Kats, um, uh, the Milk Duds. Milk Duds, Rolos. Rolos. Heath bars and the one Reese's peanut butter cups. Oh, it had Reese's in it. Yeah, I guess oh, we Andy must have gone yeah, into it Andy by did. all of them. <laughs> yeah. Um, but the last thing sitting at the bottom was all these Heath ones. All the Heath bars. <laughs> that's all that's in there now. But I love Heath bars. I really do. There used to be a car, uh, a candy bar that was similar. It was called Score. S K O R. Score. And same thing. Oh my goodness, it was good. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm not going to put this on a dimensional, but I'm going to put tape on the one side here because it's going to be hanging off the dimensional piece. So let me get that up a little. Oh, look at there. Get a piece on me. All right, well, I guess that's going to have to do. Now, I do have some sticking over the edge, so I'm just going to take my pokey tool and kind of go in here and pull it down the tape. And I guess you don't have to be as meticulous about it, but you don't want the spider getting stuck to anything else um, if you transport it or give it to someone. So anyhow, there we have it. We got our 
Amy said, can a pocket-sized hand sanitizer fit in that treat box? Absolutely. Let me go get one. Uh, do, do, do. Julie, hi, Karen. Julie said you used to love the score bar. Yes. Yes. I don't think I've had those. It's a little bit tight, but it will fit. Okay. Oh, yeah. It goes just a tiny, tiny bit, but it'll work. You can slide in a ribbon up on the top. Yeah, and mm -hmm. just tie it shut. Yep, and what I would do if I was you, I would maybe make this a little bit looser, and then it'll expand a little bit more. But yeah, I think it would definitely work. Yeah, it definitely would fit. Yep. Nice. Yeah. Nice. Pretty awesome. Thanks, Dawn. Thanks, yeah. Amy. So, Thanks, Karen. That is it, my guys. Jenny I said tell glue ya. dot, Nancy. Glue dot. Glue dot. Oh, I could have used a glue dot. Yeah. See? What Normal would people would have used a glue dot. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Kathy said, cute. Jeez. Just ordered that treat dye. Good. Good. You're going to love it. Seriously. It's fun. It's uber cute. It's uber cute. And uber and cute. and look at if you're getting if you're getting married or have an engagement party, you can do a little ring on the front, and these would make perfect little treats that you hand out to guests. I mean, that'd be cute. Pretty awesome. Stacy said, "So adorable. Love that you made your own DSP." Oh my gosh, yeah. It's I like I said before. I mean, the designer series paper they have now is not my cup of tea. Um, it's not that I don't well, like. Not, not all of it. Just it, the it, one specifically Halloween it's, related. Yeah, it's it's really hard. Oops, I did that wrong. But it was hard for me to get inspiration off of the paper. So I thought, oh, I'm just going to make my own. At first I tried it with bats. Um, the little bats from one of the other stamp sets. I think it's the... Oh, yeah. I didn't like that. Yeah, it was too tiny, too busy. I think I might even have some left. Oh, of Maybe course. Not. Dawn said, enjoyed you both. Thank you for sharing your creativity. Oh, no problem at thank all. Thank you for hanging out with us. Seriously. Lori's going to catch the replay. Yay. Yeah. Make sure you do that so you can see how we made that uh, the matching card to the treat box. Because it's Absolutely. super cute. Um, I just, I feel like Facebook and YouTube, the colors don't do it justice. Oh, they don't. Um, so make sure that you check out our blog post, which is going to go live at 8 a.m. tomorrow. And it's actually going to be on a blog, uh, hop it's that a we're blog participating hop. in. Yep. So you want to make sure that you check out all the other great people who are participating in that as well. Um, so we'll have measurements and, um, better pictures of yes. the cards and boxes so you can see that. And Stephanie Pletcher... Um, we have known her now, it's going to be two years. Yeah, I yeah, think I think so. it's going to be two years. Um, we, uh, used to do a monthly tutorial with her and some other people. And then we ended that back in June and we started up another, um, um, uh, we're doing the blog hops with her. She's yeah. hosting them this time. And, um, I found out that we actually met her in Portland, Portland. Yeah, yeah it was Portland. Um, met up with her in Portland, so it was good to see her there. But she just won her first incentive trip. Today. So, today, the, the very last, last day. day that you can earn it, she won it. We're so, so excited. Happy. So excited for her because, I mean, it it takes a lot of work to um, to achieve that accomplishment. And, yeah, she's, she's doing awesome. So super excited for her. Yes. Um, but she's hosting the, the blog hop, so make sure you guys... Check that out tomorrow. Um, she's also doing one on Saturday that we're participating mm -hmm. in for World Card Making Day, too. Yeah, so. but guys, make sure that you come check us out for World Card Making Day. You can't see our camera. Actually, you can still see our table. That's cool. Oh, yeah. um, so October 3rd, this coming Saturday, make sure you come hang out with us. Um, we won't be live live because I'll be out of the state. Mom will still be here. Um, sucker. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, but we will still be able to still interact with you to get in on the grand prize drawing of paper, envelopes, ink, stamp set, all that kind of stuff. All the information is going to be on our blog, um, which I could probably post in the comments here in a second. Um, but make sure you head over to our blog to see how you can get entered in to that. All you have to do is comment on the videos that we share. Mm -hmm. um, three videos, each of them are going to be posted, like the three are posted on Facebook, three are posted on 
YouTube, and then the same three are posted on Instagram as well. Right. Just wanted to reach more people that way so they could also participate in World Card Making Day. Um, and then if you purchase $35 with us before tax and shipping, you get the make and takes for those Ooh, cards whoop. that you will be watching on yep. Saturday. So, so purchase anything from the 3rd through the 10th, mm -hmm. um, that's a minimum of $35, you will be sent those make and takes from Saturday um, October 3rd. Yeah, I'm super, super, super excited for it. And then the following Saturday, October 10th, we're we'll going to be, be live. We'll be live. We'll be um, live on Wednesday at our usual time, but then on Saturday as well, we'll be live. Um, and then that's when we're going to take all those names, put them in a bowl, shake it up. Yep. And, and draw then, a winner for our grand prize that we're giving away. Yeah. It's like, I don't know, it's a really good Grand prize, I like, think it is. It's World Card Making Day. What better oh. than a stamp set? Oh, and... sorry. My drum roll went a little bit earlier than I was planning. Is that what I was hearing? That's what time it is. Oh, my gosh. Is it that time already? <laughs> it's that up? time to do a giveaway. I wish we could see you guys. You can't see us. I, well, or, yeah, you can't hmm. see us because my camera is just not working, so yeah. I need to figure that out. Out. Um, but we are giving away the... Don't flip it over yet because the name's on the other side. Oh. We're giving away the Happiness Blooms... Memories and more cards and envelopes. And so this winner brand was... Brand new packet. Brand new packet. Never been opened. This winner was chosen from... Uh, all you have to do to enter to win is either comment, like, subscribe, follow us, all that kind of stuff on either YouTube or on Facebook. And then mm -hmm. you're put into the drawing to win. So if you want to get next week's prize, which I'll talk about in a second, do the same thing. So, drum roll. Drum roll. <clears throat> there we go. Oh. <laughs> okay, you can flip it over. Our winner is Marlene Kruger Nickel. Yay! Yay! Marlene, <laughs> congratulations. You won this packet of cards and envelopes. How awesome is that? Congrats, Marlene. Perfect. Please message us your shipping information so we could get this off to you right away. Right away, free of charge. Um, and then, yeah, that's exciting. So, our next winner, if you didn't win, make sure you come back next week to claim your prize. You don't have to be here like watching us live you could still comment after our video is posted but we will draw a winner for the bumblebee in color ribbon um brand new, brand bolt. new bolt this will be our winner for next week um so we'll be drawing the winner after our live yay. next wednesday yay yay <laughs> super excited you guys um looking forward to this weekend, actually. I'm the super Park. excited. Uh, yeah. So, and you have a chance. Like, if you follow us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram, you have a potential to get nine entries for our giveaway. Yep. So you got to like us on the platform. You like us. You have comment. to like us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and then follow us on Instagram. So, like, you just have to engage with us that yes. way. And then you have to comment at least one time. On the video. Just At one least time. one time. Just say hi. Or say or where you're bye. from. Take a friend. Yeah. Whatever you want to do. Um, so, yeah. We appreciate it. Yeah, we really do. And then your name could be put in there for a potential of nine times to win yeah. that grand prize. Yep. That's what I said. I know. Anyway. I'm just reiterating. Okay. Just, <laughs> I think it's a good thing. I don't know. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Thank you so much, you guys, for joining us. Yes. Thanks. Have a good day evening day because uh, we have our australian friends we watching do. us too we so do. have a good rest of your day evening, evening. weekend <laughs> week it's not the weekend yet and we will see you on saturday for sure because you're going to come back and hang out with us on world car making day and then we'll see you live on the on week on from when today <laughs> wednesday yeah okay yeah okay that's it okay bye guys bye. take care bye, -bye.